uh, like double the accuracy, five microns versus 10 microns. Um, this has a much larger field of view. It's just, it's an awesome, it's gonna be an awesome scanner. So let's, let's, let's get started. Oh, wow. Okay, first off, we have our guide here. Let's see, we've got in the top here, this is pretty cool. It's got, um, it's got part of the foam in the very top. It actually has some of the accessories. So these are the these are the different bases here for the for the scanner to mount things to it. So we've got a couple accessories here. These are pretty cool. This one has oh this has actually the blue tack sticky stuff on it. So um, when we pull the scanner out, I, it actually has a magnetic base that these just clip right into. So that's awesome cords and so forth here. So we got a USB and our power power supply power cord. That's cool. Set these up here. All right. Let's see what else we have in here. All right, this is cool. We got it's a nice thick top layer here to protect it. All right, here comes the actual scanner. Going to move this over here. All right. So this scanner, this has this insert here that we can pull out like so. Now we see the actual scanner itself. So here's the, the stage where, like I said a minute ago, we can click in these different connectors like that just pop right in this swivels in this way but it also rotates like this too so we look up under here we've got four cameras these are 13 megapixel cameras the original micro only had two cameras this one has four um, again a huge field of view here it's 200 by 200 by 150 millimeter um, area. So like the size of a, a cantaloupe or so, where the old, the original micro was only uh, about the size of a softball, we would say, the largest. Much bigger field of view. Like I said earlier, this has a five micron accuracy versus the other one was 10 micron. So it's greatly improved in that regard too. Let's see, there's some more. It's awfully heavy, so oh yeah, here we go. There are more. So this is actually this is this is another mount right here that allows us to clamp clamp items into it. So there are a lot of occasions where you're going to be swinging things potentially completely upside down to to scan to get the different um, angles on them. So you're going to want to clamp things in really well. This enables you to do that. Another, less, the last main thing in here is the actual calibration board. This is the calibration board. This calibration board, like all the other items here, it just clicks right in. That looks like about it. Very well, uh, well packaged here. Cool scanner. Can't wait to get it, get it running.